What up, what up, what up, people? It's your boy, Disgusted Dad. <laughs> I just had, I, I just had to do this too. Just had a conversation. Somebody tried to throw pie in my face, talking about my man might get a, talking about get a, getting arrested Tuesday. Y'all know my boy, Donald Trump. Y'all know what he might get arrested for. He ain't getting arrested, I should say. Stormy Daniels. Y'all got the nerve to start me up today with this Trump shit, Stormy Daniels shit. That motherfucker ain't know who the fuck I am. I'm fucking Edmund Welch. I've been in Stormy Daniel relationships for the past 25 fucking years. I should have stayed a fucking felon instead of becoming a fucking legitimate law-abiding, productive member of society and end up getting caught up in this motherfucking national fucking business of horrors and pimps and you fucking, fucking punk ass swamp shithole kennel bottom nesters. You Americans should be mad. I don't, that motherfucker should have been embarrassed as fuck to try to start a conversation with me today about fucking Trump. Are you kidding me? I don't think, years ago in the 80s, I thought Trump was a fool. Right now, I think he's the best thing this fucking country got going for. And y'all know, because so many of y'all been quiet the last few years, watching your boy Biden just fucking fuck this goddamn country up. And now somebody gonna turn around and tell me today about Trump getting arrested for motherfucking paying hush money to a fucking whore. 99% <laughs> of American men are fucking paying hush money to a fucking whore like fucking Stormy Daniels. It's called child support. You motherfuckers, it, 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 it's, 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 and most of y'all ain't even paying child support and y'all still paying hush money because y'all scared to death. Y'all fucking around, hoping. Yo, pick up the dog shit before I give it back to you. You lucky I'm making a video. You don't want it on Facebook. Pick up your dog shit. I'm gonna leave poison on the street for that little motherfucker. Yeah, I caught one of these motherfucking Stormy Daniels type fucking stomach in the way she can't bend down and pick up her dog shit but I gotta I gotta if I wasn't making a video for you motherfuckers I'd go pick that dog shit up and mash it all in a motherfucking hairdo <coughs> she probably won't walk that fucker around here no more I gotta I know who she is but like I was saying <laughs> fuck around I end up having to fucking with this dog I'll get into another Stormy Daniel type relationship Paying motherfucking hush money, restitution for this fucking bitch and her fucking stupid ass fucking knotted ass fucking dog. Which yeah, like I was saying, most of you motherfuckers is paying hush money right now. How many of you motherfuckers woke up after last night's March Madness of basketball teams and college games, whether you won or you lost? This morning, most of you probably got a Stormy Daniels laying right next to you, right? Right? Come on now, this is Disgusted Dads. Don't ask me what the fuck my fucking knowledge and experience is. Let me see, I got 16 years in criminal court, followed by 10 years working in the escort industry here in New York City, followed, not, followed immediately by 13 plus years in family court. I can tell y'all every fucking day. Why y'all think Mary, Eric, Eric, Mayor Eric Adams surrounded by a bunch of motherfucking women? Y'all know what he got arrested for how many moons ago like he always talk about. He don't never give y'all the details. It's always him and some boys got arrested for trying to force their way into a woman's apartment. You see who he surrounded himself with? All the motherfucking co-workers from back in the days. Y'all know... <laughs> Trump ain't going to jail. He fucking with y'all. And finally, 
the George the George Santos attacks on the Republicans have gotten blown over because of Trump and Stormy Daniels. Yeah, they're hoping to keep his ass out of the White House running. Yeah. But y'all can't get away from it, America. Y'all done opened the fucking doors to this country's borders so that y'all got nothing but fucking Stormy Daniels coming in this country. And I know I sound a bit erratic, but mm, you men deep in your heart, y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. Y'all praying and hoping that James Dolan face recognition cameras in Madison Square Garden don't get taken over by fucking law enforcement and start hunting for you punk ass fucking deadbeats. That'll fuck up your safe space, won't it? You won't be able to, tens of thousands of you fucking men won't be able to hide in no fucking arena clapping for jump shots and half caught those and motherfuckers spraining their knee Jumping and celebrating on the, what is it, the soccer field or, or wherever the fuck, baseball field? Huh? 50, 50, 40, 30 million dollar a year contracts. And y'all worrying about a hundred and something thousand dollars that Trump repaid his lawyer who paid a bill to a fucking whore. Tell me how many of you motherfucking men in this country living like that. <laughs> Paying attorney fees for whores to get come ups. Nah, I ain't upset. And y'all should pay attention to Trump because Trump is actually litigating the way all American men should be litigating. Let's tell the whole story. Let's go to trial. Y'all see, I ain't been able to go to a trial. I've been demanding trial now for about mm, four years. They will never take me to trial because I want to talk about it. I want to talk about my relationships. I'm willing to fucking reveal my relationships and details with these bitches. Nah, Trump ain't going to jail. Could you imagine them walking a former sitting president? They ain't even make this much of, of an issue about the Epstein and the Weinstein and the Giselle Ma Max... Max, Maxine, Giselle, whatever the fuck. New York is the motherfucking, uh, what they call that? Ground zero for Nexium. Y'all forgot about them Nexium motherfuckers, right? Yeah, yeah. Christine Gillibrand, we ain't forget about you. We ain't forget about you. You know what I mean? Fuck listening to motherfucking Mr. Crump is that the lawyer named Crump and standing with uh, Al Sharpton and the National Action Network? You don't hear them talk about motherfucking family court. The amount of payments they make to motherfucking whores. But, you know, I digress. It's all family law related. It's all family law related. But, in closing, I'll ask you guys. Look at the stories that fucking pre pre lead our motherfucking national news. Whores, breeders, kennels, corrals, and the motherfucking billions that it costs to feed and house these motherfuckers. Come on now. Come on now, what y'all doing? Shit, America is in a, a Stormy Daniels relationship with the Ukraine right now. <laughs> hey, people, I see my time is running. I'm trying to see how this go. I think they gave me 10 minutes, so I'm going to leave it at here for 10 minutes. But y'all know who it is. It's Gus the Dads, demanding family law reform or exposing it because America is always family law related. You dumb citizenry. But go watch tonight's games and pay your Stormy Daniels tomorrow. Win or lose. <laughs> Pick the right brackets, motherfuckers.